If there was any suspense about who was going to be quarterback for the Eagles against the Jets, that suspense is now over. It's over. Jalen Hurts, he is one tough guy. Sore ankle? What sore ankle? Eagles quarterback Jalen Hurts says he's ready to go Sunday against the New York Jets. This after hurting himself this past Sunday against the Giants. Hurts participated in Eagles walkthrough today and is expected to practice tomorrow. Eagles coach Nick Sirianni says Hurts is as tough as they get. And of course, he is hungry to bounce back from the worst start of his career. Who can forget? Hurts says the ankle will not affect him this Sunday back at the Meadowlands. It's fine. We won't. We'll be ready to go. Ready to play Business as usual. Um, my preparation for the Jets, same old thing. Um, the Giants game has been flushed. Um, we moved on. All right, let's move on. Time is ticking. Major League Baseball is expected to lock out the players by the end of the night. If MLB and the Players Association cannot reach a new collective bargaining agreement. How about the Phillies? They are adding a much-needed experienced former All-Star to the bullpen. The Phil signed right-handed reliever Corey Knable to a one-year deal worth $10 million. Knable pitched for the Dodgers last season, but has spent the majority of his career in Milwaukee, where he was an All-Star in 2017 with a career-high 39 saves. The Union are gearing up for their first conference final in team history. And after the first two rounds of the playoffs went to extra time and a shootout, the fans, of course, could use a less stressful match Sunday against New York City. Can you do me a favor and maybe all of soccer fans in the Delaware Valley a favor and maybe try and not make it so close this time? Because it's been yeah, a little stressful. Played, we've played 140 of the most, or sorry, 240 of the most stressful minutes of my coaching career. So hopefully we can take care of things in just the, the, the simple 90 minutes. Although it's been great drama for TV. It's been great job, drama for Channel 6. It's been great drama for our fans. Um, but yeah, I, so I could sleep a little easier. I'd like it to end in regulation. That would be nice. How about a drama-free Sunday? The Union hosts New York City right here on 6ABC at 3 o'clock. Flyer star Kevin Hayes returns tonight in New York against the Rangers as they look to end their six-game losing streak. Hayes has missed 18 of the Flyers' 20 games so far, including the last few weeks after re-aggravating his surgically repaired abdominal area. Now Hayes sounds ready to go. You can't really play the game where you're hoping to do something or hoping not to get hit, and you just kind of got to give it your all. And um, I don't think anything's going to happen, uh, but again, I, I don't know. Uh, I mean, anyone can get injured at any time during the game. It's hockey. And, and um, yeah, I mean, I, I feel more comfortable now than I've felt all season and most of last season. The Sixers are finally healthy, and hopefully Joel Embiid and company can finally get on a run. Tonight in Boston, Sixers look to win back-to-back -back games for the first time in a month as they begin yet another road trip. I think this is a great stretch for us, Spike. Great opportunity. Um, you got to go play. Uh, Boston's playing better. Um, Charlotte's playing great. Atlanta's starting to roll. So it'll be fun. We'll see what we got. We'll see what they got, and they really need to get going here. They'll have their starting five, of course, minus Ben Simmons tonight. Thank you, Jeff.